Are they only, okay, I'll ask it a different way. Are all of you only able to date women? Can any of your wives right. date a man? No way. <laughs> nah, they can't date a man because- uh, Why? Also a part of the- because also a part of the polygyny is I'm going to plant my seed. So part of our knowledge that we have is that the man has the seed. It's kind of like a, a apple tree. Every apple produces itself. So the thing is, in order for us to build this nation, we, we want to plant my seed in multiple earths, multiple queens. If we put another man into the scenario, then it would be different seeds and it's not the same family structure that we're trying to create. You don't think that's just a bit selfish and egotistical? Nah. Break, nah, break, nah. <laughs> We're having a conversation. <laughs> break it down to me. Why is that not? No, it's great. No, it's great. It's great because to me, um, it's my family in a sense because I do believe in the, uh, like I do believe the man is the leader of this household. Like I said, I, I do subscribe to the father God. I do subscribe to the, the son and the father and the Holy Spirit. So to me, that's already the fabric of the design of the life we live in. What God is to me, I am to my woman, what my woman is to my to the children one day. So the order, I feel like uh, the structure, we all agree on the structure of how we want to build our life, you know? Okay. Again, it sounds a little selfish on your part, but I get it. I, I understand your, your thought process. Um because I can't have somebody having sex with my girl, right? If you're in a monogamous relationship, you're not sharing your girl yeah, with but another you're, man, you're, right? You're talking from a man's standpoint, and that's exactly how Sean would feel. <laughs> I, I would say the same thing you're saying. <laughs> and I didn't go down that spiritual journey that you went down. <laughs> uh, okay, um, let me ask you something. From a man or woman Talk standpoint, what are the benefits of a poly lifestyle? If you t if Right now, there's going to be somebody who's going to watch this and they're thinking about it, mm -hmm. um, whether it's a man or a woman, that their, their interest has been piqued. But they're scared. You know, they, what, what am I getting myself into? Mm -hmm. From your standpoint, what are the benefits? OK, so. Um, the benefits is teamwork, uh, always having a support system. So, like, for instance, everything gets done. No, no one works hard. One thing that I'm big on is I don't want no one working too hard. I don't want to put no weight on no one's back. So, like, we're running a household. I don't want the same person doing the dishes, doing the cooking that day. I don't want the same person who swept doing the dishes. Or if I, I, don't, if I drove and picked somebody up, I don't want to be the same one. Um, I don't know. Um, um just doing anything. So I think it's about lightening the load in a sense with the lifestyle. Like um, it's beneficial on that level that we don't have to stress. There's always someone with enough energy to do something. We never have to push each other to do something when we're, I'm kind of beat right now. So that's one of the dynamics. The second dynamics is um, I plan on um, doing a lot of business. So we run our own business as well. So with our business, I plan on growing it. So we have a staff, we have a we have a um, structure, um, and even before we were doing our own businesses, when we were working, we had multiple incomes, multiple streams of incomes, even from working regular jobs. So when we had regular jobs, and you got three, four people with a regular job, you know, you just you just multiplied the money as well. So it left it left room for us to um, um, invest into ourselves, and. Um, we also into real estate. So my mother's big into real estate. So we're into real estate and um, building our credit and stuff. And it also makes sense with what we're doing there because there's only there's only so many uh, loopholes in the real estate business. Kind of like when you buy the house and then you take a loan out on the house and the whole way you 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 play the system. Um, we could play that game multiple times at the same time with multiple people too. Understood. So for us, and then. And then I want to say um, having children. I want to have a big family. My queens want to have a big family, but none of them want to have more than one or two children. They all want to have a big family, but they don't want the pressure of having three, five, ten children. 
So that also uh, took the stress off that element to where we all like, cool, we can have a big family uh, and also be supportive for each other, help each other through pregnancies um, and give the game to each other, talk to each other, you know, women experiencing things, being able to share with each other. So for me, I think there's so many benefits to this lifestyle, you know, and as a man, as a man, you are um, you, you do have a, a high sexual appetite. And uh, I think it's also healthy to have multiple options. You're not just drilling one person all the time or or making somebody do something they don't want to do just for you or whatever. It's like there's always a natural flow and it's harmony. And I think that's beautiful. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.